So, I got the car. I'm going to buy a car today. Due to the fact that they chose me for the job at the school, I have to look decent when I show up to events and I will have to go all well dressed, etc. and I cannot show up with a van. So this was another reason why I decided to not get a van and one of the reasons why I decided to get this one other than the fact that it was extremely cheap. The reality is that it's not perfect. Very, very far away from perfect. I'm a little bit worried that this will not last enough and will start to break down. But for now, it's amazing. So probably tomorrow we're going to surf and I still don't know if I have to take this car. Part of me wants, part of me doesn't. I've not tested it yet. So. Feel the good tonight? We flew so high and proud In a world full of people out Cut his young ass down <laughs> Very badly. officially arrived home it's so late I'm tired and tomorrow I think we're going again to have a little surf session because I bought a surfboard and I want to, to try it I'm officially moving so baby uh, I've been a guest for the last two weeks and it's been great and I'm very very grateful because that allowed me to have the chance to like figure it out my stuff without any rush and find the best option for me. in the room all the stuff you don't see it but here is a mess I will start with cleaning making sure everything is perfect and then I will organize everything days went by and I think today is uh, the day to show you my room. Let's start with this. Let me tell you about uh, like the whole situation that's around this room. So this room is actually a cottage, is separated from the house and there are other five guys living in the ground floor and then the owner. Outside here I have a garden 
that is a shared garden and I have already had the chance to see that people spend time there. The good part of it is that I'm actually outside of the real building. So I have my own place. Let's start from the main wall and uh, is where I actually have all my stuff. All this side is dedicated to food. I decided to do that rather than keeping the food inside the house, just to make sure that what I buy, I use. I have some hangers that I would use for the t-shirt, but here I have my shirts, my jackets, my hoodies, and my pants. Here are some extra stuff. I bought these two plants just to give some vibing. And I have space for all my shoes. Here, I have a spot where I will leave my camera on, things that I use every day, socks and underwear, and then hoodies. I have all my camera gear section, obviously in the best position and obviously all displayed out. Is there a need for that? No, but I'm glad I can do that. Here I bought my dishes, my forks, my knives, my spoons and everything I need to cook. So I have everything here and here in order to not have the problem to go in the shared room and have the shared pants and shared dishes that maybe I have to clean, maybe they're not clean well. And it's a problem that I have because I like to have my things clean, in particular for food. And I just have to use these beautiful $3 basket to put in what I need to cook and the pans and uh, dish or whatever and just go in the kitchen with this set it down and I have everything clean and ready to go then up here an extra blanket because probably it's going to be cold here I actually should have an eater I'm not sure if it works I've not tried it yet my wetsuit here I bought it for 24 bucks at Goodwill used without knowing if it if uh, it would fit me or if it would be warm enough and it actually is i tried it twice and worked perfectly so here's the bed and uh, it's comfy i slept here just one night for now and i slept on these because i didn't know that they didn't provide pillows fun fact i bought for ten dollars yesterday a pillow that is supposed to get cold when you touch it. And for someone like me that likes to have a cold pillow, this is so cool and for 10 bucks. So I'm excited to try it tonight. You have not met him yet, but it's Veggie, <laughs> my surfboard. I decided to buy it because I'm planning to surf a lot because I'm here, I have the chance to do it and why not? I spent a lot less than what my budget was for the car, so I decided that I could spend this amount of money on this. Also because the guy that I was used to rent the surfboard from raised the prices not just a little bit, but um, I pretty much paid this like renting the surfboard six times, but this is mine and I can go whenever I want. I'm actually really happy. I surfed twice already and I did very, very bad both times, but the few waves that I got, um, it made me happy. So let's talk about the coolest side of all, here, where I will spend most of my time when I'm here, when I'm in the room. Uh, let's start with talking about this iconic seat. And this is temporary. I ordered a new chair, because there was not one and this is just temporary in order to make me able to keep using it but I will add some clips uh, from uh, two days from now three days from now when I receive the new seat it matches the, the vibe this will make my room like perfect here this should be an AC I think but I'm actually using it just to hold my computer that I connected to this gorgeous monitor that I bought here for $100 which is nothing if you know which monitor is this and it works amazingly another interesting purchase that I made is this one the mini fridge I bought it for 10 bucks 
let me tell you the story about. So as I said, I paid 10 bucks for this mini fridge, which is a crazy low price. And you wonder why. I went to pick it up and the owner of the mini fridge was probably a drug addict. And he was definitely high when I went to purchase it. Brought it home, checked, it worked perfectly. But I realized while I was trying the smell so probably the former owner was used to keep drugs in it and trust me it was smelling like drugs i watched it probably five to ten times doesn't smell like drugs anymore but sometimes it does so i'm still working on it another thing that i forgot to mention are the lights here this was four bucks doing all of these and purchasing all this stuff i realized that some stuff here is crazy expensive but some other are so cheap. In particular, used stuff is so much cheaper than Italy. So if you're moving here, I strongly suggest you to check always Facebook Marketplace and Craigslist before making any purchase. I finally figured out my life and tomorrow is my first day at school and at job. So I think uh, we'll start the next video with that. And um, I'm so grateful. This is so much more than what I was planning so much more than what I was expecting and I can definitely see myself live here for the next few months and I'm really happy I decided to invest this little bit of money to make this feel like home because I don't want to have to stress about going back in a place that is not my house here I feel safe I feel at home I feel like in my place and I definitely made these look like my place I'm very very happy about it and uh, that's it thank you for being here see you in the next one